Hi everybody, Chris Rock back on the Louisiana Grills patio. Today we're gonna to be making glazed mahi-mahi on the Louisiana Grills Founders Legacy 1200. Really, really straightforward recipe today that everybody's gonna enjoy. A Couple of very, very nice mahi-mahi fillets. Some parts of the country they call this Dorado, especially on the West Coast. Readily available, Florida, California, Hawaii. It's a nice, firm, dense fish. Very, very mild, so it's a great blank canvas for any seasoning or any rubs that you have. All right, so prep for the mahi-mahi is gonna be really straightforward. We've got some really nice Meyer lemon olive oil that we're gonna take and spoon right over the top of the mahi and just rub it around, get a little bit of a coating on it. Next, we're gonna take our Louisiana Grill citrus spice rub, come right across the top of those fillets, And there we have it. We're gonna let this sit for a couple of minutes, allow that rub to start to work into the olive oil, and then we're gonna go right to the grill. So everybody has a trick for their fish not sticking to the grill. Here's one that I found that works every time. I use sliced lemons, and not on top of the fish. I'll lay these lemons directly on the grill and then place my fish on top of those lemons to keep it from sticking, and it also imparts a nice lemon flavor as the fish cooks. So we've got our grill preheated to 225. We've got our lemons down on the grill, as you can see. We're gonna take this mahi-mahi now and just lay it right down on top of those lemons. Won't have any trouble sticking. And as I said, we're gonna get all that nice lemon flavor. Now we're gonna let this go at 225 degrees for about 30 minutes. And at 30 minutes, we're gonna check the fish and that's when we're gonna glaze it. All right, we're about 25, 30 minutes in and it's time to glaze with our Louisiana Grill Sweet Chili Barbecue Sauce. We're just gonna come in, nice even glaze over the top of our fish. In the next 15 or 20 minutes, this will set up and add some great flavor to this mahi-mahi. Okay, we're all glazed up and ready to go. We're using Louisiana Grill's cherry blend pellets that are gonna finish this fish with a real nice color and smoky flavor. Okay, so we're about 20 minutes after we put our glaze on. Let's check our fish and see how we're doing. Well, look at that, perfect. We're gonna pull these out right now. No stick on the grill. So with that lemon, they come right off the grill nice and easy and ready to go. And we just finished our mahi-mahi off with a little bit of green onion for garnish. So there you have it. Citrus spice rub, our sweet chili barbecue sauce, cherry wood blend pellets, all on the Louisiana Grills Legacy Founders 1200. This is Chris Rock for Louisiana Grills, and we'll see you soon.